Have you ever wondered how many pigs are slaughtered every single minute in the U.S.? The answer might shock you, over 250 pigs per minute. That staggering number reflects an entire system running like a machine, constantly working to meet the world's demand for pork. Welcome back to Farm to Factory, the channel where we uncover the real stories behind today's modern food industry. In today's video, we'll explore the journey of American pork from farms managed by artificial intelligence with fully automated feeding systems to high-speed slaughterhouses and closed-loop sausage processing plants. This is no longer traditional farming, but rather a multi-billion dollar industry built on three pillars, scale, speed, and precision. Yet, with such optimization, many questions also arise. How does that impact the environment? Are the animals treated humanely? And can this model remain sustainable for decades to come? If you've ever wondered how the food on your table is really made, then today's story is one you definitely won't want to miss. In industrial pig farming, breeding is carefully planned. Yet, caring for sows and their piglets is just as important as selecting the right breeds. The best pigs are chosen based on data about fertility, growth rate, and disease resistance. Instead of allowing natural mating, most large farms rely on artificial insemination, not only to control genetic quality, but also to reduce stress on the animals. Semen from healthy boars is stored in temperature controlled conditions. At the right time, technicians inseminate the sows according to their hormone cycles. Once pregnant, the mother pigs are moved to individual pens equipped with automated feeding systems, climate control, and health monitoring devices. After about 115 days, the sows are moved to farrowing pens, equipped with heating lamps to keep the piglets warm, protective bars to prevent crushing, and strictly controlled sanitary conditions. The piglets nurse from their mother for several weeks, strengthening their immune systems before being weaned and transferred to nursery pens. Here, everything is carefully managed to ensure the pigs grow evenly. Farms are divided into separate sections, one for weaned piglets, another for fattening to increase weight, and isolation areas to reduce the spread of disease. Temperature, humidity, and air circulation inside the barns are automatically controlled, protecting the pigs from heat stress, respiratory illnesses, or sudden chills. Waste is managed intelligently. The slatted floors allow manure to drop into underground pits. In some systems, even automatically flush it away or send it to biogas plants. This helps reduce ammonia, limit disease, and improve air quality for both people and animals. In addition, non-slip flooring, lighting systems that support natural rhythms, and enrichment tools such as chew ropes or straw will help reduce stress for pigs in industrial environments. It's not just housing, nutrition and healthcare are also driven by technology. Pigs are grouped by age and weight, with each group receiving a tailored diet designed to balance protein, fiber, energy, and minerals. Some farms even use RFID tags to track each pig's feed intake and growth rate. 
If a pig is found to be growing too slowly, the system automatically alerts staff for timely intervention. Water is provided through automatic dispensers, keeping pens dry and clean. Vaccines, probiotics, and supplements are administered on schedule, reducing reliance on antibiotics. All data is stored in digital systems, allowing real-time monitoring and analysis. This is precision farming in action, where thousands of pigs are managed simultaneously with remarkable accuracy When pigs reach a weight of about 110 to 120 kilograms, they are sent to USDA certified slaughterhouses. Here, safety, hygiene, and animal welfare are top priorities. From transport to unloading, facilities are designed with curved corridors, non-slip floors, and quiet environments to minimize fear. Pigs are stunned with CO2 or electricity before slaughter, ensuring a humane process. After that, they move on to an automated line from bleeding, cleaning, deherring, and flame sterilization to robotic cutting and separation. Every part of the pig is utilized. Prime cuts like loin and shoulder go to retail, while fat and bones are processed into sausage or other industrial products. Every step is strictly monitored by sensors and inspection staff. Workers wear sterile uniforms, tools are regularly disinfected, and all processes are recorded through digital systems to ensure full traceability. This is not just slaughtering, it is a high-tech operation designed for efficiency and safety. From there, the meat is moved onto fully automated processing lines. It is ground, mixed with spices, and stuffed into natural or artificial casings to make sausages. These are then cooked by steaming, boiling, or smoking in temperature-controlled chambers before being rapidly chilled and vacuum-sealed. Beyond sausages, pork is also turned into a wide variety of products such as bacon, ham, ribs, sliced pork, or pre-seasoned cuts ready to cook. These products are tailored to regional tastes, sweet glazed pork for the U.S., and spicy barbecue cuts exported to Asia. All are transported through a modern cold chain logistics system managed by major corporations like Tyson, Hormel, and Smithfield. Despite its high efficiency, the industry faces major challenges. Large farms emit methane and ammonia, and untreated waste can pollute soil and water sources. Antibiotic resistance remains a serious concern. Economically, the pork industry is vulnerable to disease outbreaks, feed price fluctuations, and trade bans. Several solutions are being explored, such as utilizing biogas, adopting cleaner energy sources, or implementing stricter biosecurity measures. However, the big question remains, can this industry truly balance high output with sustainability and humane practices? Today, many farms are making improvements by adding enrichment spaces, gradually phasing out restrictive sow crates, and using artificial intelligence to detect stress or illness early. 
But the question remains, are these changes enough to convince consumers that large-scale industrial farming can still be humane? From breeding to packaging, the U.S. pork industry is a high-tech, high-speed system built to serve massive market demand. But it also forces us to reflect. How can we maintain efficiency while still respecting animal welfare and the environment? If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell so you never miss new stories from Farm to Factory, where we bring you the truth about how modern food is made. Thank you for watching and for caring about where your meals really come from.